Hi, this is Connie. I am going to show you today how to how I apply my makeup. Um, this is what I'm going to do today is normally what I do, except for it's really iffy if I would use the tinted moisturizer. I use moisturizer every day, but it's uh, really iffy if I would use tinted moisturizer or foundation or BB cream that kind of stuff and powder with it. Um, everything else I use every day, but the uh, foundation and powder is more for special occasions or if I'm going someplace that I want to dress up more or that. Uh, I just got out of the shower and blow dried my hair so excuse the hair <laughs> and here we go. First I'm going to do um, my moisturizer and what I'm gonna what I've got here is is this is a tinted moisturizer by e.l.f. and it is you know kind of like a BB cream or a uh, really light coverage foundation is what it is and Elf is the company and it is tinted moisturizer it's got SPF of 20 which is wonderful we need to protect our skin and it's got aloe cucumber and vitamins A, C and E in it and it's in a light shade or fair probably uh, I usually use fair what I'm gonna do is just shake it just a little bit and it is in fair Shake it just a little bit to, and then put a little bit on the back of my hand here. Just about gone here. Then I'm going to use a beauty blender, and this is very misshapen because I had it in a container and uh, it got pretty squished. So I'm just going to move you in here a little bit. There we go. And I will just use my mirror from my... So I'm just going to put it on the Beauty Blender and just splotch it around the face here. And this just uh, being tinted, it's got it's going to moisturize me. Plus, it's going to just smooth out uh, my coloring. I tend to have a few red spots, red splotches around my face. So this is going to help with that. It's just going to smooth out the coloring, make everything look a little bit even more even. Okay. So now I'm going to use go. my eye primer and or eyeshadow primer. It is and it's by the company Ulta. And if you know there is an Ulta store. Uh, we have one here in Sioux Falls and they have their own makeup brand and that's what this is. And Ulta is just uh, strictly makeup from drugstore to high end. And this here, I'm just going to squeeze just a little bit out here. Whoops. Just a little bit on my finger. And put it on my eyelid. And what this does is, for one thing, it helps uh, with the discoloring of your lids. And it makes sure it makes so your your um, eye makeup does not crease, and your makeup your eye makeup will last all day, you know, so it doesn't rub off very easily. There's the eye primer. Now the eye shadow. 
which I am using Naked Urban Decay on the Run palette. Very pretty. And you open it up. It's got the, the rose gold. It's a gorgeous palette. You open it up. Big old mirror there. And there's a bronzer and a blush and a highlighter on the bottom row. Then the there's five eye, eye shadows. And then there's a lip gloss and eye liner and some mascara and I'm going to use everything but the blush and the bronzer today on the bottom I'm going to use and I'm only going to use this eyeshadow and this for my eyes and that's what I'm going to do right now and I'm using this is a um, coastal sense brush and it's just a flat brush flat ended brush and you use that to pack your makeup on and so here we go we're just going to use the the beige or the the neutral color and I'm going to put that all over my lid Okay, and then I'm going to use that darker brown color, and I'm just going to pack that on. And just go like at the crease and just a touch over the crease. Um, there's a lot of people that do their makeup a lot different. Um, being my age, I've got the, a lot of wrinkles, a lot of hooded eyelids going on, and I don't go crazy with my eye makeup. I just use the two shades, and that is it. Okay, I was in a car accident, so I've got a little bit of scarring going on on this eye here. Okay, many years ago I was in a car accident and did that. All right, so now I'm going to use the eyeliner out of that same kit. And it's Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil, and the color is Stag. And that's what it looks like. And let's see here. Does this roll up? I, I might have to. I don't know how this works for sure. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull my, my lighted makeup mirror a little bit closer to me here. And I'm going to use it um, so I can see what I'm doing here. I want to make sure that I can... Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm just pulling down on my eye a little bit. And I'm going... along my bottom um, I'm a little bit different I don't ever use I can't say ever but I, I rarely use eyeliner on my top lid and this one here is running out on me and it's just a, a like a little sample thing, so it it's almost gone. So it's not working the best. I should have used another eyeliner for this, but it will get the job done. So you just want to run this very close to your waterline here. Very lightly. So then I just have it on my bottom lids okay so then I'm going to use the mascara and this is my favorite mascara of all time this is called the Urban Decay Perversion bigger blacker and batter it's called there we go and it's got a very nice brush on it very nice I like the bigger brushes so 
and I just kind of roll that and I'm not seeing very well right now because uh, I should put my mirror up a little bit closer I think this doesn't work real well when you're about blind I have not figured out a way to to get it so um, I'm not blocking you when I try to look in the mirror that close. Uh, a lot of ladies wear false eyelashes. I am not a false eyelash person. I um, I just don't like the way they look. Um, I think they're some women look absolutely beautiful in them. They're just not for me. Let's put it that way. Just do a little bit on my bottom lashes here. Okay. So the eyes are done. Okay. And I know... <laughs> All right. So the next thing is my brows. And what I use on my brows is, I actually put my brush away a little bit earlier and I forgot to get it back out again, so I will find that. All right, this is what I use. And this is a Real Techniques brush. And I use, it's clean color, I've always used this, this is the only one I've ever used. It's clean color American Icon Eyebrow Palette. And this is what it looks like. This is the only color I use out of it. I don't use the wax and I don't use the darker color. I use this color here. So, I just start here at the corner and I know it looks kind of dark right there. I will straighten that out. Growing my hair out and it's really kind of a mess right now. I uh, was in a, a rather serious car accident when I was younger, and so I'm missing most of my brow on this side. It was just shaved right off of there. So I'm going to take um, a spoolie. I'm going to cut it straighten this color out with my fingers a little bit and I'm just going to brush there's my eyebrows okay so next is um, my concealer and what I'm going to use is bare minerals concealer and it's in the color well rested whoops well rested and it is a mineral concealer concealer it's like this and I'm just going to use a concealer brush there and what I do is I just get in there and I tap off the excess and I just kind of pat it on sure that you can see me here. It's a little hard to hold a mirror when you need when you almost need two hands here. All right. Get in here with the mirror here and fix this.
All right, so that is my concealer. I'm going to put everything to get back together here again. <clears throat> so now we'll use the blush, and what I'm using is, today is the Kardashian Beauty Radiant Ombre Blush, and it is in Torch, is what it's called. And this is what it looks like. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? Can't say that I am a... Um, A Kardashian fan but I do love their blush okay so just rubbing my my brush in there and then just smile a little bit so the apples of your cheeks pop up and start there and go all the way back and I do that usually twice do that over here And then I go in with a highlighter. <clears throat> and what a highlighter does is it just puts a little bit of radiance, a little bit of, of shine, luminance um, shine on your cheeks. And it, I just love the way it looks. And what I'm using today is the Natural Nude Palette by Physicians Formula. And that's what the outside, that's what the package looks like. Isn't that gorgeous? And here is the highlighter. And you can kind of see that luminescence on there and so what I do is I just run on top of that blush and then I go down and I do that a couple of times same thing with the top of the blush and then go down over the blush okay now you can just kind of see that that little bit of shine there it's so pretty <clears throat> and what I'm next going to do next is use my Ready Set Gorgeous powder, and this is just going to set everything. Use the big Real Technique Techniques brush, and I just go over everything. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. So the last is my lipstick. And what I'm using today is I usually wear um, a different shade of lipstick every day. I have a lot of lipsticks. But this one here is really lovely. And I don't usually care for lip gloss. But this one here is very lovely. This is Urban Decay Naked. Um, Urban Decay Lip Gloss and it is in this color here which is absolutely lovely and I can't read the writing is too small so I cannot read what it is but it, it's like a mauve -y nude color Okay, and it, it comes in a doe foot applicator like most lip glosses do All right, so that is, I've got one more step to do, but I want to put you back out again here. And the last thing that I do is um, I use my L'Oreal Paris Infallible uh, Pro, Spray, Pro Spray Set. And what it is, is it's a makeup extender spray. And all you do, it, it just comes in this bottle. It's a plastic bottle, and it's got a pump. And when you're all done, all you do is just spray your face. And it's supposed to extend the life of your makeup. And that is how I do. The only thing different that I normally do every single day compared to, uh, you know, once in a while is the, the, the uh, moisturizing tinted moisturizer. I use a moisturizer every day, but not the tinted one every day. And I don't do the powder every day. 
But other than that, everything else I do every single day um, that I'm going out. If I'm at home, I usually don't wear makeup, but uh, I hope you enjoyed this. And I hope in my little way I could uh, teach you something. And it takes, sorry this was so long, but, you know, it takes a while to get this gorgeous. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.